What's happening, SO Squad? It is your girl, Sim Ofebu here, and welcome back to my channel. Guys, happy new year, happy 2023. Ah, uh, you know, man, let's get it this year. Let's do important things. Let's pray hard. Let's work hard. Let's work out. Keep healthy. Drink your water. Make that money. But most importantly, put God first. Um, yeah, like in everything that you do, please put God first and he will see you through. So yeah, man, uh, my returning subscribers, I want to say thank you for coming back. Thank you for always being here, um, regardless of anything. And if you're watching this video right now and you have not subscribed, please hit the subscription button and also the notification bell so that whenever your girl comes up, you will be notified. Um, yeah, man, like I wish you guys all the best for this new year. Um, I also want to take things very seriously this year. So let's get it. Let's get it. Um, guys, so as I told you last year that I want to start doing hair content. So today is actually my first hair video and I will be highlighting a wig. Um, I'll show you how it looks right now. I've already, um, bleached it brown. Um, I want that mixture of, um, like brown and then blonde highlights so i've already bleached it brown so i've already done step one and i didn't show you guys sorry about that but yeah next time when i'm bleaching a weave i will show it to you but yeah let me show you how this hair looks right now so this is how the hair is currently looking it's a bit dry because i literally just washed it and kept it outside uh i bleached it with bleach and then washed it and kept it outside and then brought it back inside <laughs> i didn't apply anything because i'm gonna do highlights and stuff so there's no need to apply anything if you're gonna do highlights i did want to straight iron it here so it can be flatter but there's load shedding in south africa and those that don't know load shedding it is when electricity cuts off like they take it at a certain time and then bring it back again at a certain time. So right now I'm experiencing load shedding. Um, yeah, so that's why it is like this here and I couldn't um, just straight iron it, but it doesn't matter. I can still work with it. So yeah, that's how it looks like right now. So this is my bleach that I use. Um, and it also comes with this. Um, yeah, I forgot what this thing is called, but yeah. This is actually the bleach that I use. That's even the bleach that I use to turn it brown. Um, so that's what I'm gonna use for the highlights also. And then I'm gonna need my, my mixing cup. I don't know where the black uh, bowl that I usually use is, so I'm just gonna use this mixing cup with the brush and then obviously gloves. And then I'm also gonna need foil. Guys, this is literally my first time doing this um i've been watching tutorials on how to do highlights so hopefully it's gonna come out proper like i know how to bleach hair i know how to dye hair but i've never done highlights so i've been watching youtube videos and hopefully it's gonna come out proper um so this is not really a tutorial because I'm, I'm also learning so i can't say it's a tutorial but um it's just me showing you guys how i'm doing it and if someone finds it helpful then they can use it as a tutorial so yeah let me get started so i've mixed my powder bleach with the developer yeah the liquid thing is called a developer i didn't want to make it too light or too thick so i just made it like yeah like that and then you section the hair because you're going to work on it like from section to section so that's how i've tied it up here and i'm going to start down here uh, remember guys, I'm also still learning. So yeah, let's try. <laughs> so after sectioning it, you will do a zigzag. And with this zigzag, um, it's for the hair that you will actually highlight. So you zigzag it. So that means from this chunk down here, I am highlighting this hair, but I need to like do the side also.
yeah my highlights will be on this hair oh this is so tricky you take your foil um yeah and then you start bleaching the hair Then when you're done, you just close it. You move on to another section of your hair. So meaning that you need to section it again. Another piece of foil, I forgot to show you guys that in order for the foil to like stay on your hair, you have to fold it on the sides. So just fold it on the sides. I forgot to show you with the first one, but that's what I did with it. And that's how it stayed. So yeah, that's what I'm showing you now. And you must try to have some speed because if you're slow, the other highlights might be brighter than the other ones. So just try and be fast. So I'm doing my zigzag again. There's another part that I forgot to mention. In order not to ruin the front, normally you come and like, you first start with the front and do two sections, especially if you wanna have those two thick um, blonde highlights in front. So you just come to the front and section your hair and take like the two sides that you wanna highlight. This was actually the first step that I was supposed to do. So you see where my middle line is? I just come and section the side and then I section that side. Next, you take your foil and then your bleach and then just highlight them. Also, when you start with these two, um they come out you know nicer and brighter so it's advisable that you start with them well i've learned <laughs> so this was actually the first thing that i was supposed to do but i forgot but it's still fine as long as you still do it and i want my highlights to start from the roots some people prefer them from um like midway but i want mine from the roots so that's why i am doing it the way that i'm doing it okay back to my back and sectioning <laughs> So when you're sectioning in the middle, the hair is going to be a lot. So um, you can just divide it into two and then work on one side. So I'm going to start with this side um, to do my zigzag.
Okay, so now I'm finally on top. This is a lot of work, guys. I don't want to lie. Like, I'm sweating and everything. So, yeah. I underestimated it. It's a lot. <laughs> it's a lot, but I'm done. Like, literally. This is the last day. So I'm done. Um, I'm just gonna let it chill for like 30 to 40 minutes and then yeah, I'll come and wash it. Hopefully it's gonna be done. Um, yeah, I'll keep you guys posted. What ended up happening is or was um, I washed the hair after an hour and then I put it in a plastic bag um, overnight. <laughs> I put it in a plastic bag. It's been in this plastic bag since last night, basically. So um, I saw the, the trick on the tutorial that I watched. So I hope it's going to work. Apparently, if you leave it overnight, um, conditioned, you put conditioner after washing it. You condition it and then put it in a plastic bag and then leave it overnight. Apparently, it becomes, you know, nicer and softer. Like it locks in the moist moisture or moist <laughs> so that's what i did when i was washing it um after doing the highlights i used this tresemme shampoo and then this is the conditioner that i used to rinse it with after the shampoo and then also to just like soak it in the plastic bag with i use the conditioner tresemme has like different shampoos and conditioners so i usually use the nourish and renew and then for my conditioner i use the luck luxurious luxurious moisture <laughs> but yeah you decide what you want to use because it has like different shampoos and conditioners so yeah but you don't have to do it like this you don't have to like leave it overnight with conditioner but i did it so that i can see if is it really gonna uh be soft and silky more softer more silkier so you don't have to do that you can literally just wash it and then dry it um and style it but i wanted to leave it overnight so that's why i did what i did so now let's see how the hair came out um i'm gonna wash it now feels very soft already um oh and yes my highlights came out like this I didn't want them too bright, so they came out. Like this. Okay, so this is how the hair came out. I literally just took it from outside um, it's very soft oh my goodness oh my gosh can you guys see these highlights I am so happy I have not even dried it with a hairdryer or anything like literally I put it outside by the Sun and voila okay now I'm gonna hair dry it a bit and then try and straighten it and show you the final results <laughs> it came out and i love it i absolutely love it i love the fact that the highlights are not too bright um they just they just what i wanted basically
love it i'm very happy with the results and this was like my first attempt um so i'm happy <laughs> so that's it guys um i hope you've really enjoyed this video as i said that this is not a tutorial but i was just showing you guys my first attempt of trying to do highlights um for those that don't know i actually have a hair business so i'm learning as i'm growing like yeah <laughs> so um yeah thank you so much for watching this video uh please don't forget to like comment and subscribe um also don't forget to hit the notification bell so that when your girl comes up you will be notified i will see you next time deuces